since Don't Worry Darling comes out very soon, I thought it'd be fun to go back and take a look at Olivia Wilde's directorial debut, Booksmart. Released back in 2019, this film stars Beanie Feldstein, Caitlin Dever, and a buttload of insanely talented young actors. And this film tells the story of two high schoolers who, on the eve of their high school graduation, discover they missed out on having fun so they could focus on getting good grades, while all the popular kids did both. So, they decide to head out and find the coolest party and live life to the fullest before leaving high school and their youth behind. I think, for me personally, this is one of the best teen comedies ever made. I know to some that sounds blasphemous because there's films like The Breakfast Club, Ferris Bueller, Superbad, but I say this because this film is not only incredibly hilarious, but it's one of the best representations of kids from my generation. You look at the mass of teen comedies made in the past few years, and most really don't seem to know like they understand how kids these days talk or act. It always seems like the adults writing them are trying to sound cool and hip, and it instead comes across as embarrassing and cringy. So, to have a film like this that perfectly captures the way teens this generation talk and act is a breath of fresh air. As I've said many times before, the key to a good comedy is having well-defined characters that are able to stand out while also having good banter, gags, and a story that can have hidden depth to it. Thankfully, this film has all of that and so much more. While Superbad gets talked about a lot for how well-written its characters are, I feel like this film should be talked about in the same way as that. Molly and Amy, performed brilliantly by Feldstein and Dever, have this incredible chemistry with one another and have such love and admiration for one another that their charm can become incredibly infectious. These two feel like they've been friends for years and you're immediately hooked into the story because you fall in love with these characters and want to see them succeed on their mission. But it's not just how charmingly written they are, there's a lot of depth to their characters that can be really interesting to dissect and study. Molly is a go-getter that knows exactly what she wants and will stop at nothing until she gets it. Amy is someone that's a bit more timid and shy and doesn't really try to stand out from the crowd. While these two might seem like polar opposites, the film explores their differences in personalities and thoughts leads to a pretty surprising arc for the two of them that doesn't feel forced and makes even cliches like the third act breakup make sense and feel natural. There could be so many teen comedies that put barely any effort into their characters and to have the two leads of this be so well defined and different from one another is easily one of the best things in the movie. But it's not just our leads that are well written. Practically all the secondary cast is insanely well written and performed. What would typically be characters that directors wouldn't focus on much, Wilde allows these characters to really be their own and gives them all not just really funny stuff to do, but have fully realized characters as well. There are some amazing scene stealers, particularly Billy Lord and Skylar Gisando, that makes this film 10 times funnier than it already was. And that's another thing. This movie is incredibly fucking funny. With how many terrible and forgettable comedies Netflix has been making these past few years, watching this again reminds me that comedies are able to be extremely well written and funny. The way the dialogue is delivered, the sharpness and wit of the jokes, the insane gags that happen are all because these writers and director put 110% into making this as funny as it could be. Despite this being her first film as director, it feels like Wilde is a natural born comedy director. From the performances she got from her actors to the way she frames and shoots her scenes to the quick paced editing and the gorgeous cinematography, you would never know this was her first film as director if you weren't told. There is so much life in every scene and you can tell she's having just as much fun behind the camera as her actors are in front of it. And like all good teen comedies, the premise of the story may be simple, but what makes it work is not only the comedy of how these characters get to their destination, but the subtleties hidden within. Had this film not explored the problems Molly and Amy could have with one another and just left it with them being really good friends, this would be missing out on so much. I love when comedies care about their characters and want to explore them more, and I wish more would do it like Booksmart does. Booksmart is still my favorite teen comedy of all time. It's incredibly hilarious from beginning to end, all the characters are hilarious and incredibly well written, Wilde's direction is fantastic, it's truly one of the all-time best teen comedies in my opinion. If you haven't checked it out yet, please do yourself a favor and see it as soon as you can. I'm going to give Booksmart a 9 out of 10.